Caretakers at the historic homestead of a Rhode Island Revolutionary War hero say they need to increase security. The reason? Someone has been dumping a lot of trash there. It happened twice in the last two months. New at 6, TJ Del Santo continues our local coverage from the General Nathaniel Green Homestead in Coventry. Some people call this Rhode Island's Mount Vernon. Other people think it's okay to dump their trash here. It was during colonial times when one of the most important figures in American history built his home on this property in Coventry, General Nathaniel Green. General Washington, second in command and uh, most trusted general. He commanded the entire Southern Theater. It was his strategies that pretty much defeated the British in the South and forced them to retreat north. His home was in the Green family until 1919. Now it's a museum. Dave Procaccini is the president of the homestead and actually descends from the Green family. We, we have um, Revolutionary War reenactments. We have Civil War reenactments. The, the troops form up in the field, and the audience comes right here on the hillside, and they watch, watch them recreate battles that happened centuries ago. Sky Drone 12 over the Nathaniel Green homestead. Recently, people have been treating it as a dumping ground. Kind of a blemish on, on, a, on a national historic landmark site. The first time was in April. Down, we found two large truckloads of of trash. There was a, a truckload of uh, bags of leaves and landscape waste and another truckload of construction waste, mostly shingles and siding. And Wednesday morning, a volunteer discovered a pile of trash left in front of the homestead. Chairs, gas tanks, uh, and a, a bunch of assorted trash. The Coventry police have been called, but they'll likely never know where the trash came from. Kind of have a feel of disgust. It's kind of a sad feeling that somebody would disrespect the place in that way. And the Nathaniel Green Homestead is looking for donations to help pay for security cameras on the property. I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News.